Welcome back, my fellow outlaws. Outlaw Gary here, even wearing my outlaw shirt that I haven't worn in forever because, well, Red Dead Online was dead. But it's back to life, and today we're gonna try out the naturalist role. The brand new Frontier Pursuit, of course. If you guys do enjoy the video, be sure to drop a like. If you're new around here, hit the subscribe button. Click the little bell so I notified, and I am so excited to just finally have something positive to talk about when it comes to Red Dead Online. As you guys know, I was the most hopeful creator on the platform, just praying daily that Rockstar would just get it together and they finally have gotten it together. Guys, <laughs> welcome to the new update. What the heck? <laughs> Hello? What is happening right now? Oh my God. What? These guys have no pants. What? <laughs> what is going on right now? <laughs> All right, I think we are what just happened. I have no idea. Hey, it's sir. Oh, I got a new I got a new weapon variant It's a double barrel. It's a double barrel shotgun. All right, we've got to go to the strawberry inn. Just right. What is happening? Bro, I'm here to do the naturalist role and everyone's literally dying in strawberry. All right, let's just go in here. Oh hey, men, Get down here. This has got to Madam, stop. Madam, please. No. Uh, yeah, I'll be right with you. I know you're up there. Oh, marvelous. <laughs> There she is. Holy. That's what I need, a crazy wood nymph. can a man take a bath in peace? What the hell is that? It's a panther. Oh, you savage. And a nice clean one now, too. This is going above the mayor's bed. Okay, uh, Mrs. Hobbs will be by to handle the taxidermy. Oh, travel safe, my friend. Wait, who are you? Where's Cecil? Glenn, I'm a friend of his. Cecil had to take a few days off. Mm-hmm. Or stress. Is there any oh. animal that you have not slaughtered? Oh, you flatter me, Miss Sorry, Davenport. I really will be right with the you. The answer's no, but I'm retired, as you know, and have been for some time. Yes, and how many have you out there killing for you now? Not nearly enough, I'm afraid. Business is booming. What about you there? You a hunter? Gus McMillan. Am I a hunter? A craftsman of fine clothing and accessories. Here's my card. I pay top dollar for animal furs and parts. The rarer, the Don't better. Don't listen to him. Unbelievable. How do you sleep at night? On the tiger bed spread, my dear. Ooh. Seriously, come see You're me. You're no better than a murderer. I'm a murderer. Okay. I'm an outlaw. As such. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Would you mind taking this outside? I don't want Shut cover. up, Glenn. Listen, soon as a squirrel finds a cure for tuberculosis, let's oh, talk. If intelligence is the barometer oh, of who geez. has the right to live or die, you should have been court-martialed at birth. Annoying, isn't she? <laughs> see him? The only thing he had on his mind was hunger, sweetheart, but I pulled the trigger. Boom. Survival of the fittest. True. It's not your mentor's trite catchphrase. It's not survival of the fittest. You are killing to line this your own pockets. This is how I make my living. We don't all have a rich daddy. While you're camped out in the woods, making witches brews and talking to the wildlife, <laughs> the rest of us are doing some real you think work. This is some big joke. Oh, oh pepper spray. Oh, crazy. Oh. Uh, they uh, should uh. throw you in an asylum. <laughs> oh, that's it. I quit. You can tell the mayor I've gone home. <sighs> oh, sorry about that awful man. Harriet Davenport. Hello. I've been in the field now for three years, studying the hidden interconnections between animals of all species. <laughs> I've seen everything. I've <laughs> had joy, disgust, regrets, envy. Hmm. We're so much more alike than we are different. I'm on the brink of discovering the pathways that link all life. I, I just need more research material. I have Ooh. in here detailed Ooh. notes Ooh. on pretty much every animal from armadillo to anisberg, including the locations of some truly impressive varieties. I would be willing to sell this to you. Sell. If you will commit to bringing me anatomical samples from live species and promise not to carry out any more animal side in pursuit of Gus McMillan's greed. Uh oh. I'll pay you. I'll pay you, of course. Promise I'm good for the money. Uh oh. That doesn't sound very reassuring. From nature, not destroy it. I'm gonna purchase it. Excellent. I have so many gold bars anyways. Been brought together for a reason. I strongly feel that. I've been experimenting with tonics that can provide access to remarkable new pathways of communication with other species. What? You have to live as they do. Oh my she just drugged me! Toad, dig as the mole. Love. As the badger. Oh my god! I'm high! <laughs> what the heck? You see what I've seen. You just have to open your 
Bro, this lady is crazy. She just drugged us. That is terrifying. What the heck? We were literally just drugged and thrown in the forest. And does the game like, I don't know what's going on, but the game feels really broken right now. And who the hell is this guy? <gasps> Legendary animal map, let's go, and the sample kit. An animal field guide. Oh, bro, everyone's getting thrown out here. This feels like it's gonna be Griefer Central right here, boys. Griefer Central, I'm telling you. I got an offer from Rockstar. Oh, wait, what? Oh my God, look, at oh my God. Bro, I got the deal of a lifetime here. Look at all the stuff I got. Some XP rewards. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I'll claim all these bad boys. Thank you very much. Oh, 50 bucks. Oh, heck yeah. I'll take $50 for free. 1,000 XP. More XP. Okay. More XP. Let's go, baby. Five gold bars off the butcher table. I already have a butcher table. Oh, whatever. So let's think about this. We have to now use the naturalist role and figure out what we got to do. So I have a few options. I can either go with Gus or Harry. And if you guys watched my video from earlier today, I discussed how apparently you can't go with both because Harriet will know that you're working with Gus. So you sort of have to go down one path. You can't really play both sides. And I think we're going to go down the Gus side of things because it just sounds like it's a lot more fun to just run around gunning things down than like going around taking pictures. Just saying. So right out the beginning, you guys can see that it literally tells you that the hunter's path is like if you favor fine clothing over conservation and that if you do both harriet will take notice of your poaching activities if you try to play both sides of this quarrel if you go down her path though it seems like she's gonna reward you more so i'm not sure i believe we might get rewarded more if you go down harriet's path on top of that becoming a naturalist just in its own right you get a bunch of things unlocked for you so make sure you guys do it as well as pitching a wilderness camp gives you a free treasure chest which we'll do it in a future video by the way I don't know if you guys know this, but this house is from single player. And this is actually the taxidermy house. This house most likely will be used for Gus adventures. So let's make our way over to Gus and just, dudes, I am so excited for this. I love hunting and Red Dead Online. So this is just icing on the cake for me. I know maybe like we might make more money. It might be more beneficial to go with the lady, but you know, Gus is my man. So we've made it to Gus. He's on top of this mountain. And to my understanding, Working with Gus might be the better option for trinkets. Hey, Gus. Well, I just want to see what you can do for me, sir. Just, just you know, interested in, in seeing what you got for sale. So he has some stuff. So let's go over what Gus offers comparatively. So he has garments and honestly, uh, wait, I can't even see what I can't even see what it looks like. I have Gus. Are you scamming me? Oh, 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 Gus coming through with the goods. All right. Okay. I see you, Gus. I see you. Trinkets. Whoa. So he's got a trinket that permanently slows. What? Okay. So he offers trinkets. Players a higher chance of receiving better quality pelts and skins from animals in perfect condition. What? That's a great trinket. What the heck? Holy. I need buck antlers. Oh my God. That's so easy to get. Permanently increases players horse bonding rate by 10%. Picking, creeping, thyme, oregano, and wild mint herbs yields two times more herbs herbs and then permanently decreases the speed that horse health and stamina core is drained by 10%. That is insane. And honestly, these are not hard to get at all. I already have all the, the jewelry for them. I just need to go like shoot a deer, a, a buck, and that's super easy to do. This is going to be great. And if you want the variant for your bow, he has the variant for the horned variant for the bow, which I have to go showcase the brand new bow and the brand new elephant rifle soon. Holy. these oh, There's so much new stuff. So this is what we're gonna do. We've checked out what Gus has to offer. Let's go check out what Harriet has to offer. All right. I just got word of some sightings not too far from here. What? An animal apparently very unique in appearance and stature. Sounds like the perfect prize for us. Okay. Gus. <laughs> where? Where? I wasn't listening. <laughs> where? I don't. Uh, where? Where do I go? So somehow my horse might have died on the way over here, but we have arrived at Harriet. And this guy. This guy thought I was gonna kill him, but I'm not. Hello. Harriet! Look, I can't holster. I, listen, I'm trying to holster my weapon, but I can't, please. All right, so she's got missions. So, Gus doesn't have missions for us, dudes. Harriet does. This is how this whole naturalist role works. There is technically a good and a bad. Harriet is the good. Gus is the bad. She provides the missions, and then as a player, you decide how you deliver on these said missions. You can either do what Harriet wants you to do, or you can do what Gus wants you to do. But in doing so, if you do what Gus wants you to do, and that's kill the animals, Harriet 
it won't like you and won't even talk to you. So, yeah. I'm just gonna try her mission out and we're gonna see what happens. What? She gives you legendary. Ah! She gives you legendary and. Oh my god. Okay, let's. Okay, all right. What? What's going on? Okay, all right. Wait, she wants. She wants me to. She wants me to kill people? <laughs> Wait, pump the brakes, crazy lady. You don't want me killing animals, but she's okay with me killing people. <laughs> She's my type of woman. <laughs> Let's do this. <laughs> Holy, this just got so much more exciting. The Nazareth roll is dope. <laughs> Let's go kill some people. Oh my, oh my God. There's a bear over here. Okay, 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 okay. We can just go, go, go. It's coming. Oh my God, please do not run into a tree. I need my horse. This horse is so slow. Bro, why is, there's a random bear. Okay, it's still chasing me. Are you kidding me? Come on, dude. Okay, the bear gave up. That's good. So we're pulling up to the hideout right now. And boys and girls, they're not even ready. I'm the fiercest outlaw of the West. By the way, I am a little upset that I have to use this scrawny nag because my god, I think my horse is dead. All right. They're right they're right in front of me. Let's clap the Wait. The bear's still alive? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I can't see them through the <gasps> Oh my Bro, these guys hurt a lot. These guys hurt a lot a lot. Holy <laughs> Oh my, the fact that I'm not on control anymore and I have to use like, they're hacking, they're hacking. You guys wanna play, huh? Take that, take that, that's right. Yeah, baby. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I'm gonna die. No, this is so hard. We gotta drink some moonshine. Ain't no one taking me down, baby. Oh, to my face. Bro, there we go. Now we're in business, now we're in business. They're all hiding behind these. What? I'm using express ammo and it's doing, it's sucking. These guys are done for. Moving up, I'm moving up. All right, how many more we got? How many more we got? Only a few more, only a few more. I'm going in. Okay, let me just use a shotgun. Oh shoot, all my shotgun equipped. Wait, what, what the, why do I have a cattleman revolver equipped? I'm screwed. The bear is still alive. Oh my God. Oh, rebound, ready, watch this. Kobe. <laughs> that actually worked. Okay, that guy just lost his head. That guy just lost his head. That's a horse. Can't shoot the horse. There's a guy on the horse. There's a, oh, there's a there's a lot of guys over there. A lot of guys over there. Got a lot of guys. Go, 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 go. Hide, 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 hide. Oh, there's a guy here. Oh, God. Run. Don't worry, little bear. I'm going to get you out of there. There's a lot of guys, bro. This would be so much easier on controller, let me tell you. Oh, my gosh. These guys are losing their, losing their heads. <laughs> Listen, little bear. Just... Hang in there. This guy's going for the flank. Not today. Should I just let the bear go? What would happen if I let the bear out? Go get him, bear. Wait, that's not even a bear. That's a bison. What the? That thing's useless to me. You want to go, bro? Bring it. Bring it. That's right. Get clapped. I'm going in. Where is he? Come here. Get down, baby. Yeah, baby. Come on out, little bison. Look at me, dude. I'm the freaking hero of the story. All the animals were freed. I only went through two moonshine to do it. And my goodness, I need to plug in my controller because Red Dead Online with mouse and keyboard is so hard. On the bright side, though, <gasps> I can't. I can loot all of them. Oh, give me the money. Give me the money, baby. Oh my God, because they're looters and poachers, they have pelts on them and bait. Oh, this is so great. There might be some loot here too. Like just like laying around this area. Make sure when you guys do this mission, you loot all these guys. Oh, bird eggs? Let's go, baby. Cigarettes, some dala dala, some herbivore bait. Nothing too crazy yet. I wonder if there's anything up there. All right, we're in business. We got some pretty good stuff. We've got some pretty good stuff. And I got a, I got a max of whatever I have. So I guess we can go back to this Harriet lady and see what she has for us. I'm also connecting my controller. And we're back at Harriet. I've connected my controller. Hallelujah. Because my gosh. And dudes, does she have more missions or what? Okay, she has more missions for us. Wait, no. Not even a thank you or like, hey, I appreciate you. Okay, so clearly after you finish her missions, you can come back later on. Now, to start a mission when you first load her up, you'll notice that there's only these two. But on the right bottom right, you see start poached animals. Start that mission. You'll start the reputation and the relationship with this lady. And honestly, dudes, this is about to be amazing. I'm going to play this on Twitch. Twitch.tv slash JavaScript. Link on screen right now. Come hang out with me. When this video is posted, I'll probably be live over there. So come hang out. I love you guys. My goodness. This was so much fun. Even though it was a mess, it was so much fun. I appreciate you guys. And dude, let's have a freaking great week, huh? Let's do this.